Welcome back. We are here looking at the foreign exchange market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Tuesday, August the 31st, 2021. If you like to support the channel, you want to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos. And we'll start by looking at the Gravage panel in the US dollar. And as you can see, there has not been a lot of movement in the market today going back and forward. We are still running into resistance right here underneath the 40 exponential, right at the middle of the Bollinger Band. And if you get rejected here, it's very likely that will drop back towards the very bottom of the Bollinger Band, probably 1361 or at the 300 moving average, which is roughly 1375. MACD is bullish, the RSI is bearish, the CCI is flat, and the stochastic is bullish at this point. So it's kind of in tight range here. If we there is a lot of resistance to the upside, so I do favor the downside at this current stage. If US dollar starts to appreciate, then this will most likely tumble. So US dollar, Japanese yen, we can see that we are still trading within the 50 and the 150 moving average we are up at 0 0.11 at this current stage but we are just hanging around here in the middle of the bullish band we have been rejected several times this can go up this can go down so it's just complete a uh, waiting game at this point macd is uh, is bullish rsi is bullish cci is flat and stochastic is bearish at this current stage so euro us dollar you can see that we have tried to rally above the 50 moving average and kind of got re kind of got rejected it's, it's getting struggling at this point 1181 we are at the base at the top of the range here so we may fall back it towards 1170 if we manage to have a green candlestick here then uh, towards the 150 that could be possible uh, RS, the MACD is bullish, RSI is bearish, and CCI is bullish, and the stochastic is bullish as well at this point. Kind of looks like we are going to roll over and go at least towards the middle of the bullish band, probably in the worst case scenario towards 1170. So Aussie dollar, US dollar, so this is really struggling at the 0 0.73. And at this current stage, if we drop below the 20 exponential and break below these candlesticks here, and it's very likely that we'll go and retest the very bottom here, probably drop towards 0 0.70 or 0 0.69. Uh, MACD is still bullish. RSI is turning around, becoming bearish. The CCI is, bear, uh, is flat at this point in the RSI. And the stochastic is bullish as well. So it kind of looks like we are running into massive resistance where we had previous had support. So... At the current stage, I do favor the downside at this at this point. So US dollar, US and Canadian um, Canadian dollar, you can see that we have gone back and forward. We are bouncing off the 20 and the 50, 40 and the 50 uh, moving average and running into resistance at the 20 exponential. If we manage to break above the 300, then we may go and retest these previous highs here. Uh, but I do still favor the upside as um, as um, we have slowly have been gra or gradually been grinding to higher in this currency pair so i think it's just a matter of time before we get a, a green candlestick that stays above the 300 moving average and we have a crossing of these moving averages off the 300 moving average we are right here in the middle of the bullish band macd is bearish at this point rsi is flat cci is bearish and stochastic is bearish as well so may see um, a little bit of negativity in the next day, a few days there is a lot of uh, support underneath here. The 200 moving average, 150, and the 100 moving average are all underneath, which should offer support. But as long as the 50 is supported, then you'll probably go grinding to the upside. So I hope you find it helpful. You want to support the channel by subscribing, hit the like button, and the bell button to see our new videos. And good luck, and thank you very much.